In today's video, I'm going to teach you why you are stuck at your current level. And I don't care if you're low level, mid level, high level, or even the topest level. So this video is surprisingly about habits because everybody has habits. And I recently learned that all habits are actually bad because if it's a habit, that means you're doing it for no other reason besides the fact that you do it habitually, besides that it's just what you do. Now, you can't obviously put a bunch of thought into every single option you use, but what you can do, force yourself to mix it up and mix it up more often than you think you should. So let me explain. Once you fight better and better players, you need to be a master at all those options and all those mix-ups that you're not implementing enough right now. Because if you wait until you fight that really good player on the main stage, you're going to mess up your mix ups. You won't know how to use them and you won't even know all of them because you're so focused on your one habit. So let me give you an example. I actually had a really bad habit of always doing neutral get up from ledge. Even though I feel like neutral get up from ledge is really good. I would occasionally mix that up with ledge jump. I would very rarely ever ledge roll and also do some other options like dropping from ledge and doing aerials on or whatever your character can do in their unique fashion. It's very important to start mixing these up before you actually start getting punished. Even when a neutral getup will be perfectly safe, but if you think a ledge roll is safe too, I should just go for the ledge roll and which I've started to do just for the sake of mixing it up and making sure my brain is constantly aware of what might be a habit. Because at the end of the day, what gets you punished and what gets you figured out are your habits. This is kind of the downside to not fighting good enough players, but the thing is, you can't always have the best players in the world for you to have uh, there to practice. So what you do is, you know, shadow boxing, but it also involves mixing up even when you don't have to. Now, I don't even consider that shadow boxing. I consider that being a player with as many mix ups that you actually use as possible. So that's why you need to mix it up even when you don't need to. Basically, through all these habits, even though these benefited me 90% of the time when I played this game thousands of hours online, just the fact that I wasn't mixing it up was making me less of a top player. So hopefully I could find more of my habits. Hopefully you can see your of your habits. Of course, you don't need to mix it up every single time because then you're just playing RNG, but you do need to mix it up and all ha habits are bad. Even the ones you think are really good and really strong options, all habits are bad. So if you enjoyed this video, if you were able to follow me on my rant, don't forget to hit that DK thumbs up, spank that subscribe button, have a swell evening, and I will see you next time.